Okay, so here we have the uh, the case now set out on the table so that we can install the motherboard. It's quite a simple process. Uh, this is the Coolmaster 334U Elite case, as I have mentioned. Uh, I so have in pre-installed a uh, 140 millimeter fan in the front bay. There, um, with lights on it. Um, on the bottom, we can see the power supply goes, which will be in this step. This step, we shall be installing the motherboard and the power supply, which and also um, involves the I/O shield. And also removing this. We don't cut it; we unwind it like a normal person. Okay, so well, that's just boring. Don't cut the metal chain. Okay, so in here we have zip ties. If you're American, what do we call them in this country? Zip ties. No, we don't call them something else, but I can't think what it is. Yeah, in here we have a the speaker and some screws and unnotable plastic lock thing, which I can't think for the name of. Also inside we have. This is where the camera's going to come in and very useful. Yes, I think we this like this. Right, so in here we have all of the front panel connections. Oh, it's another fan. Yes, that was pre-installed. Very nice. Here we have a reset switch, uh, power LED, uh, the front panel audio, HD audio, which has got another funny connection on it, which is like ancient things, hard drive LED, uh, power LED, and USB 2.0 connectivity. Very nice indeed. So now the absolutely terrifying bit of putting the I.O. shield. Big okay, scary effect. what I was thinking Big of. scary effect at that point. Yeah, I guess that bit. But I was I was more thinking put there and that in there, but I guess that comes later. That's going first. Speak uh yeah. Okay. Well let's get that in there. By the top. way, that blue tack wasn't me, I did do that. Don't know that. Don't know that. Oh, anyway. <laughs> okay, what we do is we line it up for the way that the motherboard will be sat in the case. From the rear we push it in. This should clip in. Of course, this is all easier said than done, really, at the end of the day, isn't it? It's one of those things. Oh, bloody hell. Oh, there we go. Oh, that was easy. Oh, there we go. That's another corner. That one's come out. That's good. This is some mind-bending footage we're getting here. I believe that's it. No. Where in? Does it look in? That looks fair in. All right, let's say that's it. <laughs> now, as you can see in here, I doubt you'll be able to see it on the camera, but there is a guide actually punched into the thing, into the uh, motherboard area. And, oh no, you can see it, yeah. It shows you what holes, each of these holes are assigned a letter, and that tells you which one's going which, which is good, depending on which motherboard you have. That's a standard. For this, we are using an ATX motherboard, which is an ATX form factor on here. Which she needs to use holes A, B, C, D, E, F, J, K, and L. So if we uh, insert into those holes, A, A, to begin with. This could take a while. Alright, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to lift up the motherboard box and turn it to the correct orientation. Yes, so, so I don't have to turn it whilst I'm holding it in the air. One more rotation. It's bad because it's heavy. Right. So we lift it up, we stick it in. Should be relatively simple, however, I somehow doubt it will be. Uh, I probably somewhat agree with you there. Okay, so we're gonna go for it. I'm gonna hold it there. Oh, dear, the yeah. heavy side. This is not easy. I wouldn't expect it to be, Josh. It's a motherboard. I can't think of a better way to hold this. Josh? Yes? Why don't they have a computer? Why don't they have a daddy board? Don't know. It's a bit sexist. I know. Yeah. Well, that's not right. Is it not? I should be able to get in there now. All right, so we've, uh, with much force and effort, we've removed the blooming cover bits. Alright, so this one needs to come out as well, for the wireless card. That should be relatively easy though. I'll try not to break these too much anymore. Because I might need to put them out. Alright, that one's in good condition, that one's <laughs> That one was <laughs> That's a good one. Wow. Right, so... Right, so that's for my wireless card, that's graphics card. 
Right, now we're gonna try again. <laughs> this could be funny. Okay, so what I'm gonna do, put my finger through the PCI bracket hole, so I can ease this up to the uh, hole. They're all relatively lined up. Oh my god, it. Oh, all we need to do is you push it right in. Oh, yeah, that's, look at that. That's, that's it. That's all in. That's sorted, that. Now we need to find out which one of these screws fits the bumble. Okay, now before we do that, can we do a. It seems to be working fine. Okay, it's in the hole. This is why we need the small camera. Yes. Oh, there's not much light in there anymore, is there? Yeah, well, I'm blocking it all. That's going in a bit, isn't it? Yeah. There you go, that's good. There is, check this one. A bit tighter. Okay, right. I'm going to go. In this corner here. Next step. Uh, the last bit of this part actually is installing the power supply. How many watts is that? Uh, 600, that's why it's called the CX600N. Oh? Oh, yes indeed, oh, oh indeed. Okay, oh dear. Oh, I didn't think about this. That's not a problem though, we can just simply move motherboard headers over there. Okay, so, oh my god, anyway, right. That's the wrong way up, isn't it? Yep. <laughs> That's that's the right way up. Yes, it is. Oh, it's sat on the cable, I do believe. Do you want a hand? No, it's stuck or something. No, I haven't got a clue what it is. Fine, I'll just move that along. Oh no, that's that's it, that's it. Right, so power supply in. Power supply in. All we need to now is screw it in. All up with the screws that came with the power supply, which we've lost. Can you lift that up a bit? May need to push the uh Can you lift that up a bit? Yeah. I need to push and lift the power supply up and in just to get the things to fit in. There you go. Can you hold that there? Yep. Thank you. Okay, get one of these buttons in then. Okay. Why would this seem easier if I was to throw this one in? Because uh, it would. Do you want to do that? Yeah, go on. Can you... Lovely. Lovely jubbly. Right, now so we just, just do the two in the corner and it should be able to hold itself up if you can do that. You say two in the corner, this... Yeah, that's because it screws in here. Oh. It sort of grips onto this bit. Okay. Pass by is in. Stalled. Good. Right. right. Okay, so now we have the Corsair CX600M installed, the uh, motherboard seated in the standoffs, despite the fact three of them weren't used, very odd, and after a lot of bother swearing, <laughs> um, the uh, IO shield now has all of the uh, connectors lined up. So, next uh, next week shall be the uh, installation no, of the uh, installation cables. of the drives.